on Hidden Gems. We're exploring this really awesome pond right outside of Percival, Virginia, and we have a challenge today. We need to catch one fish every two minutes for a whole hour, okay? It doesn't matter if it's a bluegill, a bass, or crappie. Let Timer starts now. So we got two major things that we're gonna be throwing today. I got a ultralight rigged up here. This has 12 pound braid to four pound test fluorocarbon. And then I have my BFS set up with a little Eurotech jerk bait. I mean, this is a place that you can go and you can get a kid to catch almost anything that swims. Got one. First fish and took a minute 18, minute 18. What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh my goodness. Look at the size of that bluegill. That's a nice one right there, guys. That's one fish. Now again, everything I fish in here is public water. So link in the episode description to exactly where this got one. It's a little bass. It's a little bass. No, it's a crappie. A little black crappie. Little baby trout magnet. Go oh, he's cute. All right, that's two. You know, all I'm doing with this thing is I'm just shaking the line and just slowly swimming this trout magnet back to the boat. Back to the boat, <laughs> back to land. Is to get it snagged, which is not good for a challenge. You can't be snagging up on a challenge. Come on, you can't be doing that. Got one, three. I am way off, I am way off, guys. Come on, get it back in there. He's too small, he's too small, don't worry about him. So I'm just gonna cast right here for a while. I'm not gonna move. That's the other thing too I gotta think about is I only have an hour to catch 30. But again, this is right outside Percival, Virginia and Round Hill. Tons of good grass, tons of good dock and wood. Time to move. Got one. What do I got here? It is a bass, got a little baby bass. Look at him. Again, a little trout magnet. Number four, four and five minutes. I'm falling behind a little bit. He's a really nice one. And again, with this trout magnet here, four pound line, 12 pound braid. I'm using Sunline, four pound, four pound line. All I gotta do, semi slack line, and I'm just shaking the rod tip and then just bringing it back in. That's four. There's five. Oh, darn it. Got one. What do we got here? Oh my goodness, it's a bluegill. Look, I just had a bass, a crappie, and a bluegill basically in three casts. Look at him. Look at the color around him. Isn't he beautiful? There you go, buddy. Got one. What do I got here? I got a crappie. Oh! That is the freaking third crappie I've lost. Guys, let me know in the comment section below, how do you guys like to fish for crappie? Because I am terrible. Oh my goodness, I had another one when I was just talking to the camera like an idiot. I was gonna say, in the comment section below, let me know how you guys like to fish for crappie, because apparently I suck at it. It's, the bite is just mush. It's just the line's moving. There's one. There it is. Look at that beautiful crappie right there. Beautiful. That's six. What we got here? Bluegill? And no, oh, another crappie. This looks like a white crappie. I think this is a white crappie. Is this a white crappie or is this a black crappie? Let me know in the comment section below, how do you know if it's a white crappie or not? I have no idea, but all I know is that's number seven. Look at him, bluegill, number eight. And I lost my bait. They are choking that gulp. So that is eight and 11 minutes. Guys, we are falling behind. I got one hour to catch at least 30. All right, let's go this way now. Let's try to go this way, up and over. So we got eight so far. I'm, a, I'm like, I'm going with the wind here. Come on. He was a big one. That was the biggest blue I've seen in a long time. Oh, oh, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, this is gonna kill me. Okay, so I bet he's doing, he bit the tail. Guys, he bit the tail. That was a big blue go though. So 15 minutes have passed. We got eight so far. 15 minutes and only eight fish. We are not doing good for this place. If that wind would die down just a little bit, I can get that bait down. I have no idea what that was. 
Oh my God, that is a nice little crop. Look at that. Number nine. So I'm gonna go out on a limb and say this is a black crappie and he swallowed that little jig. Look at him. It's a nice little black crappie. I didn't even feel him. I just picked up and the line went the wrong way. The line was not where it was supposed to be. Oh my God, I got one another. Oh my good, I got a, I got a school guys. Oh my goodness, look at the size of this one here. Number nine, oh, I'm sorry, number 10, number 10. Ah, this place is so fun. I love this place so much. Again, like all I'm doing is using this gulp right here. Take that gulp, re-thread it on the hook. And usually what I like to do is put a touch of super glue on there just because this stuff does not like to stay at all. They're gonna still be biting and I'm gonna keep passing this tree. There's a nice one, big one. Number 11, Percival, Virginia. Little trout magnet. Got no one. Ah, number 12. Beautiful, beautiful crappie. Jiggle it, jiggle it. Keep the rod tip up, jiggle. Look at him. Ouch. 13. Spots. Can I get 15 off this one tree? I can, but it's gonna probably have to be another bait. Oh, I just lost the gulp. I just lost the gulp. Shoot. Oh, dang it. I left it on the other side of the pond. All right. It is 25 minutes. We gotta catch two more just for me to be even be on pace. Dude, yeah, catching one fish a minute would be insane. Should be running, but I don't. I don't want to like get freak people out. So when you're doing this, guys, thread your trout magnet on, and take and just dab it with some super glue. You know what? Before we go to that other spot, let's try casting right out here. Got one. You've got to be kidding me! Another crappie. Fourteen. I guess this is the white crappie. Fourteen, and we got 20, 28 minutes have passed. There's a little one right there. That counts. Got him. Uh, bluegill. He was chasing it. 15. 15, 28 minutes. All right. I'm still on pace. I'm still on pace. <sighs> Calm down, Tom. Calm down. <clears throat> there you go, buddy. There you go. All right. All right. It's 15. Halfway there. Halfway there. Got one. Ah! Six. Oh! Come back here. 16. I'm gonna feel so much better when I get to 20. Boy, he made the line freaking jump. 17. Number 17. 30 minutes. Once I get to 20, I'm gonna feel comfortable. Let's see if there's anything under this tree. Oh my gosh, there was. 18. Told you guys, this is the, one of the best fisheries in Loudoun County. Oh, he took my bait. He took my bait. Oh my goodness, this is fun. So, will I run out of bait or time? Okay. All right, let's get going. Back to our tree. We're at 18, guys. 18, and there's been, it's been 32 minutes. Let's see, we're back at our, oh! I just chucked my rod into the lake. That was freaking good. That's a big one. I can feel it in the rod. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. This is the most crappy I've ever caught in my life. <laughs> look at him. Oh my goodness, look at him. He's so pretty. Dude, I have not done a lot of crappie fishing. That's 20 off of this, basically this one tree. I gotta autograph this tree, I think like. Sharpie my name into this tree. There it is. 20, 21. A little bit smaller guy. 21. Twenty-two. This is guys, this is stupid. Twenty-three. 23. Twenty-four.
25. Guys, this is absolutely just stupid. 25. We got 25. We need five more, and we have 36 minutes. So uh, 36 minutes have passed. That's 25. Need five more. I'm telling you, I didn't realize, like, man, when crappie load up, man, they load up. This is this is what you see on TV. That's some freaking amazing. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's a that's a toad. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Get on land. Not the boat. Not the boat. Oh my goodness. Look at this. 26. Let me see if I can catch them off this one tree. Twenty-six. Oh, come here. Twenty-seven. Look at him. Twenty-seven. Twenty freaking eight. You can't make this stuff up. Oh no, I think it'd be worse if I lose the challenge right here. Nope, we're not gonna lose it right here. 28, and this is 29. It's 29. Oh shoot, he took my bait. No, it's right here. Look at this, I'm gonna recycle. Same bait, same bait. 29, come on, where's number 30? Where's number 30? Be number 30 on here. Be number 30! I did it! It took 39 minutes. Let's see if we can catch 40. All right, at this point, guys, we're just gonna put up some gaudy numbers. That's what we're gonna try to do now. I basically caught 30 fish off one tree. Something about that one tree. That tree was like a freaking magic spot, man. Oh, that would've been, that would've been 31 right there. There's a tree right there. 31. Another blue goat. Going back to the, the BFS jerk bait. We're gonna try to finish out the day with that. We still got a couple minutes. We just gotta catch nine fish, no problem. Got one. Bass. Little jerk bait. BFS gear. Oh. 32. Got one. There we go. Oh, goodness, he choked it. Look at that, guys. He freaking choked it. There's a big bull right there. Ah, 33. Guys, we caught 33 fish in under an hour. We have one minute left basically on the clock. I think we're gonna call it there. This is absolutely amazing, the amount of fish that we actually got to catch today. Link in the episode description for the location that we were at today, along with all the gear. Now, if you'd like to know how I tie my knot for a trout magnet, I'm gonna tag that video right there. And if you wanna see my top baits to be fishing in ponds this time of year, that'll be linked there as well. We'll see you next time.